Hello, I'm Nuala McGovern and you're watching Context on BBC News. President Putin says he doesn't want war in Europe, but Russia's security concerns need to be addressed. Now, Russia claims it is pulling back some troops from the border with Ukraine, but in the, just the past few minutes, President Biden has said that an invasion is still possible. Prince Andrew settles out of court with the woman who accused him in a civil case of sexual assault. There's no admission of guilt in the deal. Novak Djokovic tells the BBC he'd rather not win any more trophies than be forced to take a COVID vaccine. And tonight, with the context, Conservative peer Ed Vasey and Amanda Renteria, former advisor to Hillary Clinton. President Biden has just been speaking about the crisis in Ukraine. He said he wanted to give diplomacy with Russia every chance to succeed. He also said this. I have to leave it there, Ed. I do wonder, though, if he's not able to compete with not taking the vaccine. Is he still an elite athlete? Anyway, coming up next, the former president of Honduras developing story just in the past hour. Surrender to police after an extradition request from the U.S. on drug charges. That's all coming up on Context. In our connected world, all news is international. So, for in-depth analysis... An answer to the direct question, we have a deal. ...and correspondence covering both home and global events. Get a deeper understanding and find out what's really going on. BBC World News America. Hello, I'm Nola McGovern. You're watching Context on BBC News. Prince Andrew settles out of court with a woman who had accused him in a civil case of sexual assault. He has always maintained his innocence and there's no admission of guilt in the deal with his accuser, Virginia Giuffre. The mega drought in the United States West is now the worst in 1,200 years. And crickets and chips, we're going to take a look at why you should be making insects a part of your diet. Tonight, with The Context, Conservative peer Ed Vasey and Amanda Renteria, former advisor to Hillary Clinton. The West of the United States has been experiencing its most extreme mega drought in centuries, what was once considered a worst case scenario, according to a new study published in the journal Nature Climate Change. The gymnast and uh, the football star. So I want to <laughs> thank uh, both of you for joining us here on Context. And of course, you can find more about all these stories uh, that we've been discussing on the BBC website and also on the news app. I want to thank my guests, Ed Vasey and also Amanda Renteria. We will, of course, be back here again tomorrow. I hope you will join us then. Same time, same place for Context, context even. <laughs> Thanks for watching. When you come to this contemporary period, 